Well, today's going to be a day on the road. I'm uh, heading to Jackson Hole, Wyoming to drop off three clays that I picked up uh, from the other gallery here in Ennis. And I'm going to be putting them on display down there for a few weeks before I go to uh, Lake Tahoe. And then I'll pick them up at that time for the show in Tahoe. So I'm going to be going down through Idaho and then cutting across uh, to Ashton and uh, over the Teton Pass into the Jackson Hole Valley. It's not a long trip. It's, just, it's under 200 miles. In fact, it's probably about 150 miles. I don't have my GPS hooked up. I just figured I'd just wing it today without the GPS. <laughs> it's that far and I know where the gallery is. Alright. Idaho. Nope, can't see the Teton, it's too smoky. Alright, I'm just about 42 miles from uh, Jackson Hole. Um, there's the Tetons ahead, but I'll tell you right now, you're more than likely not going to see them because they're covered by smoke. Um, there are uh, several forest fires going on right now, or grass fires and things like that, so we got a smoke inversion, as the uh, meteorologist calls it. It's beautiful weather outside, though. It's uh, 80 degrees, and it's not muggy. It's, it's a dry heat, so it's perfect weather. I just entered uh, Wyoming. That's three states in one day. So just a little over 20 miles left to, on the trip. But this is the longest 20 miles. Actually, 19, 18 miles. But see, I haven't even gone over the pass yet. I still got a lot of climbing to do. Okay, we're coming down. I'm coming down into the uh, Jackson Hole area. Just across over the uh, <coughs> the Teton Pass. Alright, uh, just dropped off the uh, clays at the gallery. I didn't have time to shoot in the town because I have to get back home, but uh, I'm looking at the uh, Teton Pass ahead of me now, and uh, there are the Tetons way down there. It's at least clear enough to see them. Now I'm crossing the Buffalo River right now on my way home. Um, I think that's about it for the video. Uh, there's not much really more to shoot unless I feel there's something really pretty up ahead. But uh, in case it isn't, um, I'll see you guys uh, probably Friday uh, when I get back on the uh, approaching storm piece. Tomorrow I'm going to be working on the Indian woman and the baby for that website I told you about. And uh, I'm tired.